My name is Kelly Downs. I'm the director of the Arts Council of Southeast Missouri, and we are at Vasterling Suites celebrating the 10th annual outdoor sculpture exhibition opening. So this is a project that's a collaboration between members of the Public Art Committee, which include the Arts Council, Old Town Cape, SEMO Professor Chris Wibina, who's a sculpture professor, Brock Davis from the City of Cape, and uh, Annie Criddle from Dill Pollard. So the project is multifaceted, certainly. So you have to think about all kinds of logistics from how big the pieces are to where we're drawing sculptors from. And so there's so many considerations that are all talked out among the Public Art Committee. But the Arts Council is kind of the, the lead in terms of dealing with artists and getting the whole show together. Well, I think the 10th anniversary, you know, we had our juror from the first show come back, which I think is always special. But I think this is really an exploration of what public art should look like in this time and space. And so I think that's really a consideration right now is what is the future of public art in Cape Girardeau? You know, not just sculpture, but how can we expand this into different areas of our city and be as inclusive as possible? I think public art itself is an expression of the energy and vitality and the creativity of a city. It says so much about what people believe in and how they see themselves and how they're willing to accept other people. And I think all of those things contribute to the culture and the levity and the fun of a place. And, and that's what makes tourists want to come here and spend their money. And I think that that helps businesses too. We're just really proud of this exhibition and we hope that everybody gets a chance to see it and we're so appreciative of public art and the public art committee.